Okay, so now I'm going to give an overview of um, the superfood benefits or the health benefits that you can gain from consuming superfoods such as that come from grains and legumes in in particular. Okay, now we've been eating grains since the, since day one, okay, and they are very easy to transport, to cultivate, to grow, and they're also very rich in nutri nutrients and fiber as well that helps to nourish the human body. So it's no coincidence that civilization has actually begun to flourish when humans learned how to grow grains themselves. Okay. Now with regards to legumes, they include any kind of peanuts, lentils, dry beans, um, and peas. And the good thing about them is that they are very high in protein, fiber, and they're usually very high um, in phytochemicals and antioxidants that helps to um, provide a, a very good substitute for red meat. So if you're looking to become a vegetarian, or you are a vegetarian looking to add um, some vegetables to your diet that are very high in nutrition, then you're looking at certain legumes that I've just mentioned, and I will be covering all of those legumes and um, those grains so that um, you can um, add them as part of a superfoods diet, right? So yes, grains are actually good for you and legumes are good for you, but there are a few in particular actually superfoods. So I'm actually going to be going over superfood grains and legumes that you want to add for your superfoods diet. But with regards to um, them in particular, most grains and most legumes do help, help to keep your heart healthy. They help to stabilize your blood sugar levels. They also help to reduce your risk of cancer. And because of the high fiber content, they also help to um, heal and support your digestive system.